your last a superhero? You? And how about you? In the very early years of my career, believe it or not, we were not allowed to use internet on our desktops. And I vividly remember one evening when I was stuck really late at work because I couldn't figure out an Excel formula and I couldn't Google it. And a colleague passed by and by some magic, within an instant, knew the hack. He shows me the solution, saves my evening, saves the problem. That moment of relief and of empowerment, well, that person was a superhero to me. And then I was thinking on how many other occasions we are that lifeline for others. We help our parents fix their smartphones, we help our kids do their homework, we do all sorts of stuff for our colleagues, neighbors, friends and family. But those moments we don't really remember because what we are doing there, we are sharing obvious knowledge. So throughout our lives, we find ourselves on both sides of this scenario. We are both teachers and learners. We are helpers and help seekers. We have learned, so we have the power to teach and to help. Today, I want to talk about a superpower that is within our grasp a superpower called AI literacy, and how each and every one of us can play a pivotal role with helping each other make the most out of artificial intelligence. Because in the day and age of AI, we need each other more than ever. Now, if you have been living on planet Earth in the past year, you might have noticed how we talk about artificial intelligence. We are mostly totally doomed, or we are overexcited. Well, big emotions, they sell. But what fear does, it overshadows our active role into shaping this new powerful technology. So to paraphrase a famous movie, we are looking up this time, but again, we are taking a somewhat questionable perspective on the issue, again. And there's a thing. Who is we? Well-educated, tech-affine, interested, curious members of society who have the access to this technology and who also get to have a voice, like myself today or like some of you in this room today. Actually, if you are sitting in the room here in Vienna, um, I would say there's a 100% chance that you know what I'm talking about when I talk about AI. If you're watching this online, you might belong to this cohort too. But statistically speaking, 80% of global population do not call themselves AI literate. That means they would not be able to explain AI um, because they don't understand it, they don't know what it is, what it isn't, what it does, what it doesn't, where it can help, where it cannot help. And that's because they're jobs, their professions, their education, um, their geography, their networks, or simply the access to technology does not give them the opportunity to learn about it. So, while we uh, are creating a somewhat questionable narrative around AI, we are leaving most of our friends and family behind, 80%. And that is a big problem. Now, you might wonder why. Why should everybody care about AI? I mean, there's a lot of people who are far removed from technology. They have busy schedules, they have lots of obligations, health, money, time struggles. No, not everybody is a techie. Why should everybody care about it? Well, I'll give you two reasons why everyone needs at least basic AI literacy. Number one, inevitability. We won't really have a choice. If you own a smartphone these days, and so pretty much the whole world population does, then AI is already pretty much built in and will be totally fueled by it. So if you want to inform yourself about anything and be able to distinguish between fake and real, you need AI literacy. If you want to plan, arrange, optimize, do anything actually on your digital life, 
and you want to understand what's happening behind and what is being optimized, you need AI literacy. AI literacy will help you preserve and retain control over your digital life. But there's an upside too. It is a huge opportunity. After a year of heavy engagement with generative AI, we know by now that pretty much any task on any level of skills can be made 40% better with the help of AI, when humans use AI. We humans can be 40% better. Yes, we can be more efficient, we can be more effective. Everyone can use this and utilize this as an opportunity. And actually, especially those with busy schedules would profit from something like this. But, so AI literacy is a necessity and it is a golden opportunity for everyone. But we are not including everyone, right? We are leaving 80% of people behind. Now, public institutions, schools, universities, and corporations, they will do their part. Of course, they will invest into AI literacy programs and teach and help a lot of people learn. But given the pace of the technology and how fast technology is evolving, this won't be enough. Um, we will not manage to catch up with the technology. So the responsibility is on us too. We here can do something about it. We can give that superpower to others. So I'm here today to spread the idea that we can be that bridge to AI. From every knowledgeable person to everyone who yet needs to understand and to learn. So what is that bridge? How does it look like? Well, I'm hoping that soon enough we will have platforms and communities that will help us connect with each other and learn faster and better. But in the meantime, I mean, we can still meet. You can invite your mom for a coffee and show her how to use ChatGPT to optimize her hobby. You can visit your local NGO and show them some simple and easy AI tools, which you know and use, and help them optimize their operations, make them more cost efficient. I mean, you can make a tool yourself. You can give it for free to your colleagues, or you can organize a webinar, you can organize a neighborhood get-together and talk about AI and take away fears and maybe over emotions. I'm sure there's hundreds of ideas that would suit you to be that bridge to AI. And by acting as an AI educator, you will be helping raise the AI literacy of the entire society. And just imagine, if you teach five people, and encourage them to teach five more people, and them to teach five more people, we would reach everyone pretty much soon. So, this is simply an invitation. Be the bridge to AI. Turn your obvious knowledge into somebody's action. Turn your privilege into shared opportunity. And remember, every superpower is most powerful when it is shared. Thank you.